Okay, the breaking news today is that uh, SDL Trader Studio 2011 is not compatible with Office 2013, which was released a couple of days ago. And in this video, I will show you what happens when you try to open a Word document created in Word 2013 using Studio 2011. So here I have uh, Word 2013, and it's uh, the latest version the exact version is displayed here and if I go to Windows Update I can see that I have applied the latest updates for Windows 7 and for Office 2013. So now I will create a very simple document and I will save it to the desktop and I will call it Simple Document. Save and now I can close Word. I will go to Studio and this is the latest version of Studio, Service Pack 2 R. Just in case, I will check for updates. Next. And I'm being told that uh, Studio is up to date. So I will select uh, Open Document and on my desktop I will select the simple document I created. And now I get two error messages. One is related to the Word 2007 filter. And I'm being told the file was not created by supported version of Microsoft Word application. And the second one is related to the bilingual workbench filter. And I'm being told the document is not bilingual. So I click on OK and I'm not able to import this document. Now we'll switch to MemoQ and it's MemoQ 6.2, the latest version. And I will try to import the same document. So I'll select it here and open. MemoQ had no problem importing it and I will open it for translation. And it looks just fine. Now I will do the same with uh, WordFast Pro. Open file and this, this document here. And again, no problem to open this uh, sample document. So in a nutshell, Studio 2011 is not compatible for the time being with uh, Word 2013, while on the other hand, MemoQ and WordFast Pro had no problem to open a document created in Word 2013. I also tried with uh, four other tools, which were Deja Vu, Cafetran, Heartsome, and Swordfish, and all of them were able to process this document without any problem. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to my channel, and see you in the next video.